That school officer is on paid administrative leave tonight pending the outcome of the investigation. Why are you on his name? This video circulating on social media, a Brockton school police officer placing a student in handcuffs, his knee restraining him. The officers getting involved was a little bit jarring, I'd say, because they it usually doesn't get to that point. Usually teachers break it up. In a robocall going out to parents Wednesday evening, the superintendent says it happened outside during lunch at Brockton High School and that the student was arrested after the student was alleged to have physically attacked another student. The people that filmed that, they um, just caught the police just arresting the kids. They really didn't catch the, what really happened between the other two kids fighting. The superintendent's call goes on to say the way the student is being restrained during the arrest has been cause for great concern, adding the video was painful to watch, particularly given its historical context. He's only a little kid, you know, and he's with the officer looks real big. You know, he don't need to do all that. Thank you. Thank you. That officer is now on paid administrative leave pending the outcome of the investigation. Brockton police are gathering and reviewing all available videos from both cell phones and surveillance cameras. Parents and students at the high school tell us they're not surprised by today's incident. I kind of worry a lot, you know, I said, oh my God. Because uh, when they sent the message, I said, oh no, what happened now? To have like stupid stuff like that keep happening and disrupt our learning is super frustrating. And school leaders say they will provide support and resources to any students who want to discuss or express their feelings about today's incident at school tomorrow.